Good afternoon, Needham families. Uh, this is Mr. Purley speaking, and I am going to walk you through the Dibbles uh, Home Connect letter that was picked up either at parent-teacher conferences um, or sent home in your child's folder. This is take one. First, we're going to review uh, the different levels of these early literacy skills um, that students go through and there is a linear or logical pro progression of these. Um, there is LNF, which is letter naming fluency, FSF, which is first sound fluency, followed by PSF, which is phoneme segmentation fluency, NWF, nonsense word fluency and it's broken actually into two scores CLS correct letter sounds and WWR whole words read that is followed by DORF which is oral reading fluency and then finally TRC which is text and reading comprehension so you see the progression of skills here from students identifying letters um, all the way up to first all the way up to TRC which is reading uh, text first sound fluency is the ability to orally reproduce the first sound of a word PSF is segmenting a word into sounds cat k at nonsense words correct letter sounds are short vowels um, that aren't real words at all like Z-O-G Zog and that's reading it as a whole word and then oral reading fluency is reading any text uh, with expression and also being able to understand that text and TRC the text reading comprehension goes from kindergarten skills of being able to find the cover of a book uh, to flip through a book in the correct order, holding a book correctly, all the way up to reading books uh, of significant length and answering questions uh, from that text uh, up in the third and fourth grade level. So I'll bring up a report here. Um, this is a sample student um, from first grade. And on this report, um, you'll notice a few things. It says their grade level. This was the beginning of year assessment. We do give these assessments three times a year. So you'll get this again in January and then again at the end of the year. Uh, here it indicates whether the student is well below grade level, slightly below grade level, or at grade level, or exceeding grade level. If it's green, that means they have met their goal. They are at grade level. And then the other colors we'll see down here highlighted as well. TRC, that is a green C. It is green because C is the expected grade level in first grade at the beginning of the year. This paper also gives us some of the information of uh, where the students are and what things we can do at home uh, to help. Teachers also use these reports because it's what they use in classrooms uh, to find out where students are and what instruction can be given um, in the classroom. Here we'll see that our first grader at the beginning of the year on the PSF uh, skill, uh, phoneme segmentation, uh, this child scored 43, which is kind of their in that goal range of above 40. Nonsense words. And this is the correct letter sounds. They actually scored a 55, which is significantly above the expectation. And nine on the whole words read. So they read those words uh, very well at this point. And then uh, here at the bottom is the TRC level for a student in first grade. Uh, again, meeting the goal. There is some good information here of the examples of what each of these skills looks like um, as the students are practicing those. This is a two-page report. On the back, 
gives you some information as far as what your child uh, could do at home uh, to enhance their the next steps of their reading uh, progression and then with this student here it even has some reading comprehension uh, which is taking them to the next level hopefully this was uh, informative and helpful uh, for you to understand dibbles the dynamic indicators of basic early literacy skills um, for students in kindergarten first grade and second grade Thank you.